Played to the back line. Matthew Thomas off the bench. Christian O'Neill peels out of traffic to the back line. Fanning on that one on a chance for Peter Walton. Brunt back the other way. Chelberg shoots. He scores! Simon Chelberg, the freshman, the rookie of the month in the ECAC, has struck its 1-0 RPI. Yeah, this is O'Neill looking for the defender to, to be able to tee up a shot, but great job by RPI pressuring up at the top of the slot here. You're going to see right off the deflection of where he's like deciding if he's going to pass it along. The goalie's got to play both sides. O'Neill trying to break down the pass there, but just an excellent shot on the low side of the glove. Race on to the near side corner. Paolini faked it, got it for Kellenberger. Kellenberger gave it away. Burgess in front, they score! What a setup, it's Tor Linden on the finish. 2-0 RPI, elite goal. Yeah, another goal created by RPI off a turnover here. I mean, they're putting really good pressure on Princeton in deep, create that turnover, driving towards the net and just like, Furland really doesn't have much of a chance on this one of where when you're putting it right into the slot area on a goalie, I mean, you have so much room to go on, and Furland did uh, the best he could, but Linden just able to put it into a, a whining uh, empty net there. Aganelli will be kicked out, Gorman will take it. Gorman won it back cleanly. Walton into shooting position, a shot, and a save by Savory. Paolini ahead fake, steps right down the boards, leaves a man in the dust. Paolini behind the net with plenty of space out in front of him. Big shot, save Savory as he denies Fallon. That one was Billy Jerry, whipped around to no one in particular, taken on here by Spencer Kirsten, holding on to it. DeLang peels off in the corner. 10 on the power play. Drive by Andonofsky, save by Savory. Back on the stick of Kirsten. He'll shoot, that's why. Simon Shelberg opened up the scoring on a breakaway in the first period. Laid through center ice. Here's Burgess ahead, a shot, and it hit the post. Tigers pick it up and lay it out to center ice. Could have numbers the other way. Quickly across. Ferner into the middle. Now a chance for Babichuk. Faked it, now shot it, and Furlan made a save and held on to it. 4.57 to go here in the second period. Still 2-0 Engineers, but the Tigers are pushing. We'll step aside. Spot off ice, opportunity for Jackson Cressy. Without numbers, Cressy right to the net, backhander saved by Savory. And he's got the potential rebound as well. Best chance of the night. Yeah, Cressy just not able to get across. He was really hoping O'Neill was going to be able to come in down from the uh, left boards there. Uh, but he saw he had no real passing option, so might as well take it myself. And uh, there with, with uh, getting on Savory. Don't know if he was going to try to beat him across uh, the left the left pad or the right pad there or try to go five hole, but uh, Savory really uh, putting on a clinic out there. D-zone draw. And won and held on to, pushed in deeper by Jake Morello. Patrick Polino has some space in the corner, comes right to the top with it. Polino, a shot from a tough angle. Furlan was ready for it, and he squeezes it. And they went one of three in the loss in February. Shot, and that drew the pipe. Big rebound, loose right in front, and jumping on it is Savory. Tom had the shot that came through, and that could not beat Savory either. We'll step aside for a break to Pattage. Whips it across the ice. Paganelli onside. Cuts in. Paganelli backdoor feed. O'Neill couldn't get it away cleanly. In front, Paganelli. A backhander saved by Savory. And the rebound cleared to the sideboards and just out to center. Kirsten downstairs for O'Neill. O'Neill to Padich. Has room. Let's it go. Deflected score. Hit a body in front on the shot from to Padich. And the Tigers get a power play goal. They trail 2 1. The fans get a little see a little action of the uh, light show here. Great puck work by Princeton to be able to get this around. I mean, uh, they, they, they were able to maintain control the entire time on that power play. Great look to the point to be able to get this shot off of where you see the puck driven in uh, in deep. No clean play there to Andonovsky as he's driving through, getting it back to the, uh, getting it back to the point there and uh, driving all that to Badage and being deflected. Not quite, quite sure if that was Andonovsky that was able to get a piece of it in the end. Cressy in for an ozone draw. Against Linden. Face off one by Linden. Big hit back in front. They score. The puck came bouncing out in front, and Princeton has struck again. It's Jake Paganelli to tie it up. Well, as I said before, you don't see too many mistakes by RPI. That's probably their first one in the corner. Great pressure there by Princeton, able to get it. That one chipped back out. I don't. I couldn't tell actually at first that that was Princeton passing it back, or if that's actually a chip out. Yeah, you see, it's a bad breakout pass there in front of that. A no-no in hockey. Never want to put it towards the net. Paganelli in the right place, the right time to tie this game up. And the engineers have to backtrack out at the center. Could be a three-on-two the other way if they hurry. Kirsten trying to navigate his way on through, but he's cut down, and Riley can pivot out to center. 
Quickly pushed along. Polino, backhand, holding onto it. Shot, save, Furlan, rebound! He squeezes it at the post and he got the whistle! Ryan Furlan made the save. It dragged across the goal line, if you will, and then he stabbed it right along the post to get the whistle. We'll play it high in the air. Riley whacks it towards the Princeton end to Padage across. Walton towards the net, bouncing puck. Here's a chance! Tom! No. Did not score. It was right as the buzzer was coming down as well. My goodness. Overtime begins. Sudden death. Into the middle. Shot by Burgess. Save Furlan and Tom was ready for the rebound. And Paganelli, rather. Who Under 20 to go. Riley spins out of traffic with it. Riley backtracking. Let's a shot go. Save made. Rebound in the circle. Handled now by Cressy. He'll wing it around, but not out of the zone. Taken on here by Riley. Throws it at the net. That's blocked it a bit wide. Taken on by Zeke, back to the point. Babichuk steps around, shoots, save Furlan, rebound. They find a way out of big sprawl in the crease, and Furlan keeps it out. Time expires, and the game ends in a 2-2 two -two draw.